hello guys welcome to this video now today you're gonna learn something about this YouTube channel link which is the URL all right so right now as you can see I have this youtube.com slash channel slash and some letters and numbers and so and so so what if I want something like www.youtube.com slash my name all right so how do you get the custom URL for your YouTube channel so for that what you need to do is you need to click on this uh, picture which is your profile pic you'll have to click on this picture and then right beside this creator studio you'll have this YouTube settings all right a small gearbox you'll have to click on YouTube settings as soon as you click on that YouTube settings tab you'll have something like this opened up and you'll see advanced this is the section where you'll have to go right now so click on advanced and as soon as you click on advanced it will show something like uh, you are eligible for a custom URL or let's say if you are a newbie on YouTube you have recently joined it might have happened that you might not be eligible for a custom URL so you might have something like a claim or maybe get some custom URL or something like that all right so now eligibility for a custom URL depends on certain parameters so let me just walk you through a couple of parameters so to get a custom URL for your channel, your account needs to meet these requirements. Number one, be in a good standing. Now, what do you mean by be in good standing? So let's just move ahead to this YouTube. All right. And let me click on my channel. And as soon as I click on my channel, I'll have this video manager. All right. I'll click on this video manager. and i can have this channel so once i click on this channel it will show all these things all right so if i have all these things in green color all right if i have all these things in green color so that means my account is in good standing so it will show me to enable these features your account may be have to be in good standing all right so right now i'm in good standing according to community guidelines all right so if you are in good standing then you would be eligible for your custom URL so that's one of the points all right so that is just one of the points let me just walk you through other points now the second point is you should have at least 100 subscriber all right 100 subscriber on YouTube now probably honestly this is something which is conflict uh, conflicting right now all right this is some conflicting data maybe Google has not updated this data because as of now as you can see today it's 19th of December 2015 and recording this video and right now if you see on my channel let me just go back to my channel uh, my channel so on my channel if you see I only have five subscribers all right so I only have five subscribers right now and as for the data on YouTube or maybe Google data it says that you should at least have hundred or more subscribers so this is something which you can neglect right now probably because my um, account is in good standing maybe that might be the reason also I'm also satisfied in this third option which is be at least 30 days old so my account is right now old enough all right uh, I have created this brand new account maybe uh, it was in September or October I, I don't remember exactly but it's obviously like since I mean it's more than 30 days obviously it's more than 30 days so I'm satisfying that third point as well on top of this first one then I have also uploaded my photo as a channel icon all right so I have this channel icon photo and the second part I mean the last part is having uploaded your channel art so this is my channel art I have also done that so out of this five points only this point is not being satisfied by me let me just highlight that all right so this is the only point which I have not covered but still it's not facing any difficulties when I'm clicking on uh, this custom URL option all right so it says that I am eligible to uh, get a custom URL and it says claim it here so let's just click on claim it here and let's look what it gives me so it's loading right now let's just wait for a couple of seconds
so as soon as I have this uh, right now let's go further down now if you are qualified for a custom URL you'll see a notice in your advanced account settings or you might receive an email notification or you might also see a notification in your creator studio dashboard all right so as we have already got that that's not necessary for us so now what we need to do is to get your custom URL follow the steps you go to YouTube and so and so and once you click on get a custom URL box you'll see a custom URL you have been approved for all right now this is something which you cannot you cannot change all right so as you can see now once it has loaded all right once it has loaded it says get a custom URL which is this one all right so in the custom URL box you will see custom URLs you have been approved for so now this is by default uh, a URL which I am approved for so basically this automatically takes your Google Plus name or your YouTube name as it is so you don't have to write anything over here or maybe if you want to write something like videos all right that is Google uh, so your Google Plus ID would be something like google.com slash plus Pratik C. Chodasma videos and uh, this would be your YouTube that is youtube.com slash C slash Pratik C. Chodasma all right so let's suppose if you don't want this and uh, if you want this as it is which is youtube.com slash C slash Pratik C. Chodasma then what you can do is you can say I agree to terms and services and you can say change URL or be careful all right don't just change this right now what you can do is you can just hover and and wonder about if you want to have any changes first then make some changes because this URL won't be changed later on all right so if you are sure enough that you want this particular URL only then and then you can click on get URL or get URL over here all right so either which one click on get URL and that's it all right so let's say I want this one only so I'll say change URL and it gives me an error like many people have the same name add a few extra letters or numbers to this URL to get one that is unique for you all right so maybe what I can do is I will write something like youtube.com slash C Pratik Sik Chura Sama Pratik Sik Chura Sama is awesome all right yeah so this is nice <laughs> this is looking nice so Pratik Sik Chura Sama uh, maybe I just put up a uh, capital letter so it, it looks nice all right so Pratik Sik Chura Sama is awesome and I'll say change URL and that's it bingo so now before I confirm my choice I can also see over here how my URLs would look like so are you sure you want to change your public URL to youtube.com slash C slash Pratiksi Chodasma is awesome and the Google one so if confirmed then you can click on uh, confirm choice and it will be start it will start claiming it and there you go so now your URL has successfully been changed all right your URL is successfully changed so now onwards I don't uh, I mean I, I won't be having any crappy numbers and letters over here for my URL I would only be sharing this particular URL which is youtube.com slash C slash Pratik C. Chodasma is awesome that's it so this is how you can change your URL and as for the latest update on like right now it's midnight all right <laughs> so you can say it's an update on 28th December all right it's just been a couple of seconds it was 20th all right so yes as of 28th december this is the update and this is the way you can update your custom url for your youtube channel all right so hope you enjoyed this tutorial and may you can change and claim the best possible url for your youtube channel so hope you had some insights see you inside another video till then take care stay awesome bye bye